happening today. The Pasco School District is going to present plans for rezoning at a public hearing. Officials are opening up a magnet school. ABC Action News reporter Larissa Scott explains why leaders hope this new K-8 through school will help with overcrowding. Pasco County school leaders say they've been planning the opening of Starkey Ranch K-8 for a while. It's the first K-8 school in the district. The Magnet School is being built in the Starkey Ranch subdivision, and at today's public hearing, officials are proposing to draw the boundaries that include the neighborhood, but then also have spaces available in the school that are going to be open for people to apply to. Officials will also propose other boundaries to be adjusted to accommodate future growth and ensure parts of neighborhoods are zoned for the same school school. Staff is recommending boundary changes to Longleaf Elementary, Odessa Elementary, River Ridge Middle, Watergrass Elementary, and Wesley Chapel Elementary to be effective July 1st, 2021. Leaders are hoping the appeal of the new Starkey Ranch Magnet School will pull students from other schools to help with overcrowding all over the district. Officials tell us they anticipate continued growth of about 1,000 to 2,000 students a year for the immediate future as people continue to move to Pasco County. Every time the district builds and opens a new school, it has to rezone, which has been multiple times over the past few years. So it's certainly not unusual in a school district that's growing like ours and we're having to build new capacity to take care of that to have a rezoning uh, every year. That's not uncommon. And coming up in our next half hour, how Pasco County school officials will address the growing number of COVID-19 cases across the district at today's workshop. Reporting from Tampa, Larissa Scott, ABC Action News.